Hello everyone, Bandita here with Where in the World is Carmen San Diego. Let's take a look at this intro and I'll get back with you after that. Here we go. Here we are. Greetings, Gumshoe. Your Acme Babbling Translator is fully charged. Please type your name or select a detective from the list below to sign in. So, I don't know if a lot of you remember this game, but this came out in the 90s. It was a way to educate you on geography while catching a crook. So, where in the world is Carmen San Diego came out? Um, you know, they had the game, they had the game show I mean this was just an amazing game that I grew up with and I was finally able to get it to work so I can stream this so I'm very excited um, before we get started I actually found a PDF of the uh, manual so I was able to pull up the suspect list so I'll just show you that now So here's a suspect list of Carmen's Val Gang. These are the suspects we catch before we ultimately get to Carmen. Um, I do have a marker. I'm using Paint 3D to kind of cross out um, who we have on our list. And basically I just mark it like that. And I save it and you'll see it marked. Um, and that's how we're going to go. It's just an easier way to keep track of who we caught and it's just uh, amazing that I was able to find that. So that's just our suspect list when we catch our crooks. We're going to just cross them out as we go along. So I, as you can see, I did already start a profile, but I'm going to start a new profile for streaming so we can start from the beginning. And we're going to enter. And play with this name. Here we go. Hello and welcome to Acme. Hello, I'm Chief. I'm the Chief. But you can call me, well, the Chief. We're in the business of tracking down thieves. And we're ultimately after one. Carmen San Diego. Every creep we've ever collared has been working for her. Now. When you report for duty, I assign you a case. You go to the scene of the crime and look for clues about where the crook took the loot. Then the chase begins. Any bystander is a potential witness who can point you in the right direction. When you finally catch up with the crook, you've got to bust him. But remember, you can't arrest a crook without a warrant. And you can't get a warrant if you don't know what the crook looks like. Now, I could tell you lots more, but... The best way to learn a job is on the job. So, are you ready for your first case? Of course we are. And I just want to uh, send a shout out to IRP Lynn Thickpin because, you know, she died. Um, and she was amazing as the chief on the game show and the game. Um, just want to see if it'll let us go through. Oh, no, it won't let us do it. So, basically, this game is just... Piecing, uh, talking to locals in each destination, piece together a warrant, using the search to search for what, you know, key clues they might have us, um, 
they might give to us and this is where we drag it we can drag what they say to us and paste it here they can give us a clue not only where the suspect is but um details about the suspect as well their hair color their gender what what um artifact they're wearing height weight so we'll go through all of that usually the first case is pretty quick and I just I'll just kind of show you my method in playing this game I'm pretty fast although I haven't really caught Carmen I don't even remember if I caught Carmen ever but yeah let's get started and let's go uh, to our first destination catch our first crook here we go it happened in Peru gumshoe Someone sponged up the headwaters of the Amazon River. Ooh, Peru. They didn't look like much, but these mountain rivers are mighty important to South America. That's why you're going to bring them back, right? Right! Yes. <laughs> All right, first destination, Peru. El vuelo 324 está a punto de salir para Peru. Now, usually you can skip this part, but usually I just let it go. All right, here we are. All right, here's our first uh, local. May I help you? Where did the suspect go? He said he was leaning Pisa? toward visiting a certain tower, tower Pisa. in Pisa. He looked like he had poured an entire bottle of peroxide, peroxide. on his so head. So it's a he. Here's our warrant. It's a he and peroxide blonde. So that's where we are. Now you see leaning tower Pisa. Here you can actually search in keywords and it'll give you here Italy. Obviously, we're going to Italy. So this is the section where you can search the keyword of uh, anything. They can give you either a dish, a popular dish, or um, something like that to get the next location. What seems to be the problem? He wanted to visit the city where Leonardo da Vinci. He had fair, fair hair. hair. Now, even though you already know the location, it's good to talk to the locals to get your warrant you know, as early as you can. Said, he said there was a gondolier in Venice who would help him float alone. When I saw him, I was tempted to ask, That's how's the, the weather up there? So we go to our warrant. He's very tall. Here's another person. Do you need some? His billfold was lined with lira. Lyra, that's the... He could, he could have painted the Sistine Chapel ceiling without what scaffolding. And these, there's letters and stuff on the floor that you will, that can also... So, spring and slender patient sent a bunch of helium balloons and was lightly... So he's skinny, he's thin. So we're almost done with our link here. And here's a um, link up here. How do you say? Meet me. Already know a bit of Spanish, so. Encontrémonos en el mercado. So that appears every so often. So let's just hurry up and just go to Italy since we already know. Now, usually I'm pretty fast, but I'm just taking it a bit slower than I usually do because we have plenty of time to catch the so, And that's how you know that you're in the right place. These cleanup dudes shows up. Look, those bumbling janitors. They must have been cleaning up after your crook. Good tracking. Yep. Well, hello. He's drinking tea steeped in the Himalayas. He answered to Blondie. Wow. <laughs> How can I help you? By golly, Nepal. I said it Nepal. was folly, but he's head. Oh, do I spell that right? Yep, so we're going to Nepal, but I want to find out about How the suspect. Can I help what you? is he wearing? I thought a stick figure had come okay, to. Okay, so we already know that. Another one of these. Good morning. How do you say? Good morning. Now, I don't know Italian. Italy, but with per my... favore, aiuto. Buongiorno. Buongiorno. 
Now, I don't know a lot of Italian, but that kind of... Do you need assistance? When he mentioned that the world's own... His hair was so light, you... Yeah, I just need... How can I help? I thought a stick... Okay, so we're going to Nepal. Now, a lot of times, you would type in a clue, and it might have multiple countries, so you have to get more clues. Here's the cleanup crew again. If you want to learn more about a location, try calling up one of the Acme Good Guides. I we never usually use that. If you do, you can call back that good guide later to help check over your warrant. I usually never use that. <laughs> I thought we should. May I help you? Word Cairo, so we're going to that Egypt. He's planning to set up a pyramid scheme. He looked like he had poured okay, an entire... Okay, we already know that he has blonde hair. Can I'm trying to see what else he has. What seems to be... He said that the Red Sea. Yep. He seemed to look... Okay. What is he wearing? Do you need assistance? He was probably the same... He planned... No one's telling me... Oh, I had to stand on tiptoe. Okay, so let's go to Egypt. And sometimes you might accidentally... Hold on. And sometimes you might accidentally click the wrong country. You need to hurry up and... Yeah, this is the babble link that gives us the amount of time we have until we have to solve the case. Patient complaints of persistent headaches. We already know he's tall. I need something else here. May I help you? He looked like he had poured an yeah, entire I, I found a farewell from him penned in Filipino. So are we going to Philippines? Come on, hurry up. How do you say? Meet me at the wow. marketplace. I have in no Arabic. clue. Aina Dora to the camp. Kabilni Fisuk. Kabilni Fisuk. Oh, I just guessed that. May I help you? He looked like he had poured. Did I already? Did we already talk to her? Ah, dresses that yellow. Yeah, yeah, we know. We yes, know. I got a good look, look at, at it. Look at his kneecaps. We know he's tall. Hi there. This hood wears some kind of hood. Finally, he's wearing a hat. Got it. Issue one. Uh, I forgot. Where are we going again? What? He left behind no, a letter with the words. My geography is pretty good, but uh, I still go back and research just in case. <laughs> All right. Here we go. I just got word that the crook is meeting Carmen to hand off the loot. You've got to make the bus before they make the drop. And make sure you arrest the person who matches the description on your warrant. Yes. Okay, so here we are. That much left. So who we're looking for a tall, thin male with blonde hair and a hat. Like the chief said, you have to match your warrant. Even though, even though you might have caught the quote-unquote right suspect, if he does or she does not match your warrant, it's game over. So tall, thin, blonde hair, wearing a hat. Let's go. You just search. It's not him, obviously. Not him, too short. He's the guy, He's the guy. I'm sure, but I always go through, make sure there's nobody else that matches that description. And then, when you're ready, click on him. Yes. Stop thief, you're under arrest. Here we go. <laughs> Loophole captured. Carmen will find a way to get me out of this. <laughs> I love reading good news about my agents. Nice work. There's no, problem, no legal Chief. loophole for loophole. And next Christmas he'll be getting a lump of coal. We went through hours of questioning with no luck. But... Just before the cell door slammed shut, we heard the crook shout, I'll steal the planet's treasures till there's nothing precious left. Hmm. Code, perhaps. I'm faxing it to you for further reference. But Carmen's Cretans have committed another brazen burglary. I'd like to assign you to the case. Will you take it? Of course we're going to take it just to go over a few things um just the facts is a lot of stuff um uh is what they 
when we interview the suspect we catch that usually comes up and chief just usually sends us a fax about it and keep it on note um so what we just went through there is just a quick overview of how carmen san diego was played now i usually play a little faster sometimes if i already know the location i don't even ask the location and i know it says thank you goodbye i never say thank you goodbye because you know as you get further in the game the babble link down here goes faster and faster and faster usually i i try to if i if i get to half and i'm nowhere near there catching the suspect i ramp it up even even quicker i usually try to get the warrant as soon as i can as you saw there i got the warrant in about what two countries three countries the only thing we were missing was what the suspect was wearing but usually i talk to everybody try and get a warrant quick if i already know the country we're going sometimes i don't even ask the locals where the suspect is i just ask tell me about the suspect because you want to get that warrant in and good to go and charge and then you can just focus on the where does suspect go so you hurry up and country hop basically so that's usually how i play the game so this next case i'm going to do it as if i usually do it that first case i never usually let it get this low because the first case is supposed to be the easiest as it's just laying the groundwork of what you're supposed to do and everything now the notebook is very useful if you can't really remember a place or a keyword that a local gave you that might be key for you typing it in here in the search now um there are times where you might run into a keyword, you type it in and it will show multiple countries. So what you do is hurry up, talk to other locals, see if there's other keywords that match the countries you've seen previously and go from there. So let me pull up our suspect list and we want to cross out loophole. Now, as you can see, a lot of the suspects names of, uh, car uh, carmen's gang they're you know they're puns basically um well not puns but they you know they make sense they remind you of other phrases and stuff like that so let's cross out loophole where is he all right right here all right so loophole is done we got him and i'll just put a number one next to his name because that was the first suspect we caught so yeah let's uh let me put that list away there and we can continue on to our next case now we're still a rookie you'll notice as we progress we'll get uh promoted and that's how the game start moving very quickly all right here we go let's take a new case gumshoe the folks in korea are itching to see you because somebody <laughs> swiped their kimchi. They eat that tangy cabbage concoction alongside virtually every meal. But this morning, had kimchi before. someone it's so sold good. a recipe. Soul food just won't be the same till you get the recipe back. Go to it. Aye, aye, chief. South Korea, here we come. <laughs> All right, let's go. Good day. He was heading to Florence, Florence to Italy. visit the hut. Like His hair was the color dirt. of dirt. So it's a he and brown hair. I usually don't. How do you say? Water. I yes. don't know. Chongsa. No clue. Okay, tailor receipt and short job, short customer. So he's short. May I? Have he said he was so leaving going to Italy, toward so visiting us. He's got a. Okay, we already know we're going to Italy. What about the seems suspect. to be the problem? The word I would use yeah, to describe. already know. Okay, let's go to Italy. You see how much time we lost just on that first country? Gotta move quickly, gotta move fast. Mm. 
clean up crew. Goodbye. See those klutzy guys with brooms? They're Vile's janitors cleaning up after a thief. You must be on track. Thank you, Chief. Don't have time to talk now. What do you? He had a midday meeting at okay, the intersection. Might the... My Doberman is taller than he. Okay, we already got his height. What's this? Maybe your crooks or something. Grizzly bear in color here. I already know his hair color. Hi. I suggest so he's by the Panama land on the canal. Southern... He's a whale of a guy. So he's fat. Yeah, they're not very uh <laughs> nice in that regard. Usually I don't pay attention to the babble links, but it gets me. I don't know what this is. How do you say? Secret password. In this. Parola d'ordine segreta. I don't even know what that does. The, car the version of Carmen San Diego I had, I don't remember seeing What's that. What's your suspect's cruising a coastline? He must be taking pictures of cars. Okay, so he has a camera. Issue warrant. So we're going somewhere in Central America. Panama. There we go. Let's go. Let's hurry up. Gotta keep your eye on that Babylonian translator. Um... I guess it gives us more um, time to look for the suspect. I never realized that when I first played the game. Oh, he laughed. So we're going to Cuba. He was obviously. Okay, so I already got a warrant. How do you say? How do you say? How do you say? In Spanish. Ha visto una mujer vestida de rojo? Come se dice? Encontrémonos en el. I already know. Como se dice? Okay, so we're going to Cuba. Usually when I have a warrant and a suspect, the suspect is already, we already know the location. I hurry up and go. So we're going to Cuba. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Yep, clean up crews here. How do you say? Zero. In fact. Actually, isn't it? Zero. C? I don't even know what that means. Rubble cook exposed. I have no idea what that's about. Yeah, we already know what he looks like. Now we just need a location, location, location. They never talk to you unless everybody is cleared out the way. I hear he's trying to elude the cops by hiding in the Great Pyramid. Cheops, Egypt. Okay, I mean, of course I should have. When you see Pyramid, of course it's Egypt, but had to make sure. <laughs> Right. You'd better work fast, and here's why. Carmen is coming to collect the loot. You need to find and bust the crook before the handoff. Got it, Chief. Now you see how the babble link is still all half there? That's how you work. You gotta work quickly. So let's look at our warrant. Male, brown hair, short, heavy, with the camera. Let's look around. Not him. That's him right there. Not him. Not him. All right, so we found our person. How can I help you? Bam! Donna Hut. <laughs> These names. I'm taking a dive for Carmen. You'll never box her in. Yeah, yeah. Great work! You've tossed yet another crook in the clink. You tracked him down and found him out. Now Don in Hout is over and out. Oh, you made the arrest, hot. you made I'm an the investigator, papers, and you've made investigator. You're promoted, and I salute you. Thanks, Chief. There's another case waiting, investigator. 
Will you take it? Yes, I will. So just as you see right there, um, we've got promoted. We're investigator. That means the cases get harder. The Babylink translator down here gets moves quicker and you got to be really be on your toes. Now there have been times where I've mistaken. Uh, I thought I had the correct warrant and the correct person, but it wasn't that person. So you got to be careful. You got to make sure your warrant. I can't stress this, this enough. You got to make sure your warrant is intact. Because if your babbling is like a little bit, then you have to hurry up and go and say stop thief. And that'll be one of the quickest ways to get that suspect. Okay, so we're going to go on another case. Oh, wait, actually, let's bring up our list. Down and out. Okay, find you on the list. Okay, you're right here. All right, so we got down and out. Our second suspect there. So we got down and out, loophole. Um, so we're just going down the list and continuing. All right, let's close that. And let's go on our next case. The Netherlands are mad today because someone took their dikes away. In a country that's two-thirds below sea level, the <laughs> dikes keep the water from flooding the land. So if you don't get them back, things will get foggy fast. Grab your galoshes, gumshoe, and get going. Aye, aye, chief. All right, so we're going to the Netherlands. Let's go. All right. Yes, what is she claimed the bravado to climb the so Ojo Spanish country? Could the frames around her eyes? So it's a she and she's wearing glasses. Now it can be sunglasses or just regular ah, glasses. Glad she said she was going to a friendly country, but expected to be greeted by some stony. She was well fed, but not ex So she's about average weight. What's that on the floor? Compare her middle length pants so she's about average height you just need her hair color yes she was headed for a place that looks like switzerland I'll but instead of all her shades looked pretty okay so so we're going to bolivia okay come on lady hurry up why i couldn't see okay. She was off on a jump. Oh, let's we get this right. <laughs> so we just need to get her hair color. It's not Bolivia. It must be Chile. Oh gosh, I'm wasting time. Crap. Bueno, Está a punto de salir para Chile. Crap. Up crew. Do you? I heard she wrecked a jalopy to miss. I'd say her size was scarcely. Kinsengani? Crap. What do you need? She's traveling north to Zambia? Zambia on a. At her weight, she can probably. Oh my gosh! Are you serious? No, what get out you, of the way. What do you need? Average, average, weight, average. Okay. Need hair color. I'm wasting time. How do Siete. you say? Siete. Yeah, I know. What? She's become a maniac from Maniac, also called. I noticed that her stature was quite. I actually don't know where we're going. Oh, Kenya? Oh, we're going to Africa. I know that, but where? Oh, I'm just picking one. <laughs> Tanzania or Zaire? Oh man, this could be very bad. Crap. It's 
Zaire. It was one or the other. Damn! Bonjour, voyageur. The Congo is the center of Africa. Ah, see, we wasted all that time. Let me get her hair color. Oh, word has it Punjab, that she's India. Across. I imagine her hair turned that color over time. So it must be gray. Born in India or Pakistan. Punjab. I need to hurry up and pick. Border of India, Western border. Yep, that's Pakistan. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where'd oh. she go? I noticed she was reading the Straits Times, the largest English-speaking newspaper. Southeast Asia, Singapore. Let's go. Come on, come on. Okay, so she's average height, gray hair, medium glasses. So that's her right there. Not him. Not her. Well, her, but different color. Not her. Yep, it's her. What seems to be the problem? Yes! <laughs> Auntie Matter. I thought my apron would be a good enough cover. <laughs> Ooh, that was that was just real quick. I was just reading about your success. You've done an excellent job. Because of your fine work, Auntie Matter has cried uncle. The problem is there's already been another major burglary. Yeah, we know. Can you lend your expertise to another case? Of course. But first, let's go on our pull up our suspect list and cross her off on Team Matter. She's actually right at the top. That's an ugly looking three, but we got her. So we got Loophole, Dawn and Out, and on Team Matter. So making progress. It's just going to get tougher from here. I was afraid that I was not going to make it. I was like, oh no, are you serious? Can't be happening right now. But yeah, I was like, yeah, trying to make sure that we, um, trying to make sure that we're on the right track, basically. Um, let's see. Okay. All right, so we're going to go on our next case. It's just going to get tougher from here. Like you think you know where you're going, but they give you like a broad keyword and you'll type it in and then multiple countries will come up. That was what I just, we just met there. And sometimes if you know a general area and it's only like one country in that area, like the Southeast Asia part, the only country in that area in Southeast Asia on that list was Singapore. So I just need to hurry up and get that in. Let's take our next case. Greece is grumbling because some hooligan hauled off a hunk of its heritage. The Olympic flame is missing. There'll never be another Olympic game without that flame, so you've got to find it. Oh, and bring me back some baklava if you get a chance, okay? Thanks. <laughs> uh -oh, this would Carmen. be a routine scheme, but with you on the case, I'm looking forward to an exciting chase. Oh boy. Let's go to Greece. Alright, let's start. Where are we going? Okay. He wanted to samba along the samba drome. He was obviously intent on getting a Okay, so he and I think he has a camera. Oh, what's that one for? Keep a hairy die blowout, midnight special. So that's black hair. Oh, did I just let that guy walk past? No. Do you check the lowlands, jungle, highlands, South America. or his hair match? Yeah. Okay. Did I already talk to you? Okay. He wanted yeah, to. I did. This is the guy I missed. Greetings. 
The tropical basin where he plans to sweat it out is no... I noticed that his stature was quite ordinary. So he's about medium height. Born in South America. Closest one is Brazil. Amazon River. Makes sense. Let's go. Portuguese. Hello everyone, Bandita here with Where in the World is Carmen San Diego. Let's take a look at this intro and I'll get back with you after that. Here we go. Here we are. Greetings, Gumshoe. Your Acme Babbling Translator is fully charged. Please type your name or select a detective from the list below to sign in. So, I don't know if a lot of you remember this game, but this came out in the 90s. It was a way to educate you on geography while catching a crook. So, where in the world is Carmen San Diego came out? Um, you know, they had the game, they had the game show I mean this was just an amazing game that I grew up with and I was finally able to get it to work so I can stream this so I'm very excited um, before we get started I actually found a PDF of the uh, man <laughs> okay what can I help he left behind a Cologne. business card from a coin. Ah, Argentina. That's where we're going. I'm not looking through that list. Oh no. Oh uh, crap. I'll just say Panama. I don't know. This isn't good. Bienvenido, viajero. En Panamá sí que sabemos canalizar el agua. Ah, yes, my guess was right. <laughs> Hello. He mentioned something about barking like a Valdez. sea lion on the back. Of course it's not there. Tell me what he said he was going to write an iguana. Gazoo Falls, I gotta look that up. Have you seen a woman How in red? Say? This one. Have, Have you, you seen a yep. woman in red? Second one. Ha visto una mujer vestida de rojo? I know, thank you. Are, weren't we just there? Brazil? We were just there too. Oh, I don't know what we're doing. Tell me what you need. He said. Oh gosh, we're going back. What? He seemed to have an Strait angle on the Strait of Magellan. Chile. Okay, let's go. South America is getting. Oh, God. Whatever. Weren't we just in Argentina? El vuelo That's the... Está a punto de salir para Argentina. Que disfrute del vuelo. Oh, God. That's the only one that makes sense. Yes! Alright, let's look at our one real quick. Male. Black hair, medium height, thin with a camera. Not her. Not her. Not him. 
There he is, right there. Alright, he's the only one. And you can always change your warrant. Hello, stranger! Bam! Gotcha! Less cash. Hey, I'm caught, and I have to cash it in, but the smart money's still on Carmen. <laughs> we'll see about that, buddy. Great work! You've hit the headline! You've landed less cash in the cooler. Les and his finances will be frozen for a long, long time. That's great work, investigator. Or should I say, senior investigator. Promotion. Congratulations. You've mm -hmm. just earned yourself a promotion. But you can't rest on your laurels for long. There's already been another heist, and I'd like to assign you the case. Will you take it? Yes, I will, but first, let's go to our suspect checklist. And less cash. You're done. Suspect number four caught. All right, so we got our four so far. We got another case. All right, let's uh, get our list out of the way there. And... Okay, let's take another case. Evil is lurking in turkey gumshoe. Some foul fisherman stole every anchovy from the Black Sea. All those savory pizzas and salty canapes will be bland, 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 unless you catch the creep who filched those fish. Go to it. On it. Going to turkey. Okay, so these clues are going to get even more difficult since we got a promotion and the Babble Link will be going faster. Yes, she told me her trickery in Teotihuacan. She peeked through her aperture and said I was photogenic. Okay, so it's a she camera. It's this. Very lean, so she's skinny. Wait, did I change that to female? I don't think I did. Hello. She said she was headed for a capital city in the mountains where factories raised. Her height was pretty basic. Basic, so she's average height. Well, she was humming yep, about yeah. Mexico. She could probably work for the circus as a tightrope. <laughs> okay, so let's go with Mexico. Sometimes, even though you didn't complete your warrant in the country, it's good to hurry up and get to that location because you don't want the Babylon. Oh. Clean up crew. Good. That's how you know you're here. Hi there. Where we going? She was buying a flashlight for exploring the caves. Miss Cole. Yeah, of course. Sorry, I didn't get what the... Her height was nothing. Buenas How noches, I already know. Buenas noches. May I help? She planned to treat herself to a plate of the best goulash in town. If you ask me, she could... What do we have? Her hair color. Okay. Well, she wanted to roam the plains like her hair's the color of a rust. A rusty roof? So is that red or is that gray? <laughs> Hi there. She planned to space out at the spa on Lake Balaton. It's mag star. Hungry and... Let's just go there. We'll figure out her hair color later. Clean up crew. Do you go? I heard she wrecked oh, a jalopy we just and there. Oak. She took a snapshot to remember. Need hair color. Yeah, I know she has a camera. What? 
From Boma to Goma, the African country where she's headed is large enough to fill the eastern... She's a genuine 24... Carrot top, okay. So she's a redhead. So we're going to Africa. Where was it? Zaire? Yeah. Congo. Come on, let's hurry. She was Indy in a Kush. rush to oh. mush. I saw that wrong. Wow. This is terrible. Afghanistan. Yeah, let's go. Afghanistan. Got our warrant. We just have to hurry up, get to our locations, and catch the thief. Oh. Yes, what I loaned her quite Rubies. a bit of cash. India? Which, she, if there were two, get back here. Walking, so what's fast. on your mind? She was heading to a country Continue. pretty near Ch India. Rupees, that's the currency of India. So let's get a look at her. So she's female, redhead, medium, thin, wearing a camera. Nope. There she is right there. Oh, wait. No. And it's her. Do you need Bam. a pizza? <laughs> you may so have clever. stopped me, but you'll never arrest Carmen San Diego. We'll see about that, girl. We'll see about that. Nice detective work. You've upheld Acme's standard of excellence. You landed Leia D. Land. Her horizons will end at the jailhouse wall for a long time. But Carmen's already got another evil recipe simmering. Are you ready to take on another case right now? Yes, of course. But first, let's check off Leia Deland off of the suspect list. Let me bring that up. All right, where is she? Leia Deland. Am I blind? I don't see her. She's, oh, there she is. So I say I was like, uh, where? Okay, so we have her crossed off and that's our fifth suspect. Okay. All right, now, since we got that done, we shut our suspect list off. We caught five so far.